Woody Nerdigans. This is the one only Packer Girl 89 and today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Detective Conan chapters 1039 and 1040. So, um, the reason why I'm having to do a double chapter live reaction for Detective Conan is because my man's is making me cut back. Uh, and it's because of lack of donations. So, seriously, help this channel's on fucking live support for real. But anyway, um, uh, last, uh, ch last time I covered Detective Conan, which was a while ago, um, uh, we basically had the show Don't Hide, we've been, um, and, uh, we got, we, we basically got all the confirmation that we needed, uh, in regards to Sarah's situation, and, and also a Kai situation, too, that Sarah is a Kai's sister, and, and the little girl we saw with her is, um, their mother. So it's gonna be very, very interesting with that whole situation. But anyway, let's get to this chapter and see what happens next. So this is chapter 1039. Iori, I, could I hear it once more to verify? Of course, um, Miss Momochi. Do you really mean that, he, Do you really mean that, Heiji-kun? Don't make me repeat myself, idiot. If that really happens, the new case begins. Uh, that master and servant pair in, um, uh, that master and servant pair, Uka, Momochi, and Niori make their distinguished appearance in a luxurious car. And, and this chapter is titled, uh, 1039 is titled Momochi's Challenge. An elegant scheming face? I'll do anything you want! Eiji! I'm excited to see Eiji. What should I do about dinner? We've already used up way too much of, um, uh, of our budget for this month, so we'll have to economize. Ah, a discount coupon for, um, uh, Jinki, uh, Jisukan. And the summer holiday starts tomorrow, so let's stockpile some um, energy to stave off the summer heat. Hmm? A message? From Momichi-san? Uh, dear Mori uh, Ransama, this is uh, Uka Momichi. Please forgive me for writing you so suddenly. I have a code that I would very much uh, very much like for Kudo Shidichikan, whom I met in Kyoto to solve. I shall forward images of the code. A code? The treasure is here. One, two, one, 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 two, one, one, one. From your real ma ma Madrid fanatic mother. The treasure is here. Zero, 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 four, eight, zero. From your real Madrid uh, fanatic mother. The treasure is here. And then it's all zeros. From the real Madrid fanatic mother. Um, dude, these fucking things are weird. The treasure is here and it's all these fucking different arrows. From your real uh, Madrid fanatic, fanatic mother. The recently deceased long-standing housekeeper of a wealthy person sent this code to her four sons just before her death. I understand that she wishes to leave the marvelous treasure she had bestowed by, uh, been bestowed by her master before the, her passing to her sons. It seems uh, that she loved um, mysteries, and so in, in order to ensure that her offspring had, had to work together uh, to reach the prize, she sent each of them uh, only one sheet of the code. However, soon after they had exchanged their codes, all communi communication from the eldest son suddenly ceased. Ooh, maybe the eldest son had already solved the code and encountered some kind of trouble at the location of the treasure? Uh, that's what the three brothers inquired about, um, at that wealthy person's house. Which is why said wealthy person, uh, requested our Uka household who, with whom, uh, they are connected, uh, solve the code. From what I have heard, uh, Kudo Shinichi is a renowned, um, high school detective. In truth, I wanted to write to him directly, but I do not have his contact details, so I reached out to you with whom I had exchanged contact details instead. I happen to be coming to Tokyo today, so I shall tell you more at 4 p.m. Um, on the roof of the Haido uh, Central Building. Wait, that's only three hours from now. I need to call Shinichi imme immediately. Uh, but talking to him directly seems kind of embarrassing still. Maybe a message would be better, given I'd have to forward the code anyway. Summer holidays start tomorrow. Um, uh, We can play uh, games at the professor's house nonstop. Yes, let's enjoy ourselves. You should play too, Conan Kun. Uh, yeah, it's alright. He's currently absorbed in a different kind of game. A game called Code Breaking. Well, well, I guess. What's up with that code? Rand sent me this code. It seems that there's something more to it. And, have you solved it? Nope, I have not a clue. Um, what's wrong, it's a Kun? Is it itchy? Yep. It so suddenly started when I ate these rice crack crackers. It's a normal shrimp flavored rice cracker, though. Kojima Kun, does it, t does it itch when you touch shrimp, uh, shrimps or crabs? Uh, crab? Yeah. It always itches when you remove the shell from a shrimp, right? Not at all. It doesn't itch. Dude, you're fucking stupid. You have an allergy. Then, since we can suspect you have a shellfish allergy, Kojima Kun, you mustn't eat any more of those rice crackers. No way, but I love these. No I'm eating them. How many of them did you eat? First I ate three, then I ate two, and now you took one away, so I only ate four in total. Jeez, seems like Kojima Kun's addiction. Uh, uh, <laughs> that's an addiction, sorry. Seems like Kojima Kun's addition and subtraction need to be cured, too. Addition and subtraction? What? Oh, no, no, nothing. Hmm. 
um, Shinichi still not replied, and it's almost time to head over to the Hydro Central building if I don't want to be late. Maybe I should call him after all. I'm home. Welcome home. I got a call from Shinichi Nichan. He said he's too busy to go to the Hydro Central building, so he told me to go there with you and listen to the explanation for him. If uh, we're leaving soon, um, I'll just quickly drop my backpack off upstairs. Okay. Why did he call Kanekut in instead of me? Well, maybe Shinichi is also too embarrassed to call me directly? Ran! Oh, Ran! Um, it's that tall building, right? The Hydro Central building. Yeah, but I wonder where, whether normal people are allowed on the roof of a building like that. You must be Koto Shinichi-sama's associate, uh, Mori, uh, Ran-sama? Uh, yes. We have been expecting you. Please head on inside. Eh? Tori cutting Kaza John? My baby Tori! What are you doing here? That's what I want to ask. Could it be that moment she called you here? Yeah, that's right. I love Kaza Ben so fucking much. I'm sorry. Does that, does that mean Moment G asked Kudaka to solve the code? Yeah, that's right. I knew it, which means it'll be a competition between me and Kudo. What does that, what, what does he mean? Actually, around noon today at the school gate, um... Three hours earlier? Hey, Chikun, I hope you passed the first term agreeably. Huh? Momichi, was it? What's up? The truth is, I have a special favor to ask of you. Hmm? A favor? Um, I see. Because the eldest son might have, uh, solved the code and encountered some, um, and encountered some kind of trouble when he found the treasure. Uh, you want me to solve the code and check out, and check out the place? Um, but, uh, seeing how the eldest son probably just took the treasure for himself and ran, ran off, there's no real, pro uh, point in solving this. Uh, I see, so you can't solve it either. I didn't say that, did I? Uh, I didn't, I didn't say that, did I? I could solve this little code faster than anyone. Than anyone? Then if there's a high school student who could solve this faster, faster than you, that, uh, you'll grant my, grant my wish? Sure, fine by me. Hold up, Heiji, do you truly mean that, Heiji Kun? Don't make me repeat myself, idiot. If that really happens, I'll do anything you want. Oh, no! Oh, no! Yori, uh, yes, I have saved the recording. I'll do anything you want. Oh, that sneaky bitch. I will tell you all you need to know at 4 p.m. today on the roof of the central uh, of the Hydro Central building in Tokyo. 4 p.m., that's only three hours away. Wait a minute, Momoji, it's all right. I have prepared a pl I have prepared plane tickets to Haneda for you. Now, that's not the point here. It's your choice whether or not you come, but please understand that if you don't come, it shall count as Ms. Momoji's victory. That's what we were told. Damn it, Momoji, you sneaky bitch. That's what we were told, so we boarded the plane and rushed over here. Isn't this kind of bad? I mean, wasn't Momoji so interested in a Tori kun Yes, it's obvious that she wants to press him into marriage. Uh, Heiji just said something like she probably wants to play Karu uh, Karuta with me one more time, like uh, when we were kids. I see. I did wonder why she asked uh, Shinichi instead of Hattori kun So, Ranchon, I really don't want to ask you something like this, but could you tell Kudo come for me that this time he should let Heiji. Hapachan, that's against the rules, wouldn't you say? Momoji's voice? Momoji's voice? Where is she? Ah, uh, there's something on your chest, something like a brooch. A microphone and, a sp and speaker? Back then? Wait a moment, Momoji. It's all right. Bad motherfucker! Jeez. Back then, um, Momoji's butler must have sneakily attached it. Momoji, you're eavesdropping from somewhere, right? Don't sneak around. Show yourself. Then I shall do just that. All right, bring it on, Momoji. Since it's any Kazuha-chan, hmm? The circular line that's painted on the ground. Could it be that... Could that be... Um, I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. What on earth is going on? The race to solve the ever more mysterious code begins. I'm Luka Momoji. No need for greetings. Tell us what we need to know already. Well, there's really only one thing to add. On the code, it's set from your real Madrid fanatic mother. But apparently the woman had never watched a single match of football or soccer, as we call it, in, in her life. What? What? All right, let's get to um, 1040, which is titled from your real Madrid fanatic mother. West versus East, the, right, the race to the resolution of the cipher starts, sponsored by Ukabomachi. Um, on the code, you said, um, on the code, it said from the, your real uh, Madrid fanatic mother, but apparently the woman had never watched a single match of football or soccer, as we call it, in her life. This time, the mystery is, um, uh, the sheets of, uh, sheets of code left to four sons by their deceased mother. Should she never watch any soccer at all? So that means we're supposed to pay close attention to the real Madrid part. Um, that's written in the middle of the, co uh, um, of, uh, the code, right? And the first three codes, the ad, um, is bolded, but, um, in the last code, the red is, is bolded. Why? Oh, 
I don't see Kudo Shinichi Kun anywhere. Can you can you enlighten me as to why? I messaged I, I messaged him the codes, but he couldn't make it here since he's busy. So Kona Kun and I came here to hear you out instead. However, if Kudo Kun isn't present, it'd be much more adv uh, advantageous for Heiji Kun. No, it's okay. Shinichi Nichi is on the phone with me right now. Seriously, why Kona Kun again? Um, well, no matter. Seriously, Rad. What the fuck, Rad? Use your goddamn brain. Um, ready, set, and off we go. Let me know when you solve the code. Between Kudokun and Heichikun, the one who delivers the answer first will be the winner. I'd like to remind you that someone's safety is at stake here, so you must not, um, so you must, uh, waste no time in cracking the code. Also, in the case that, uh, Tori-sama uh, loses to Kudosama, he will grant Miss Momichi's wish. Ensure you don't neglect your promise. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah, gotcha. What, what's that, what's that about, the wish? Probably just some nonsense or other, so don't you worry about it. Is that so? Now then. Heiji! You're fucking stupid, I swear. Now then, why don't we go eat something? After all, it, it, um, is it not said an army marches on, um, its stomach? But why Tokyo was the starting place? The housekeeper who created the four sheets of code prior to her death uh, worked at a wealthy person's mansion at Haido City in Tokyo. That's why I thought um, the treasure she had bes been bestowed by her master would also be located in Tokyo. But then wouldn't uh, the treasure be uh, hidden somewhere in that mansion? If the son's hunting through the... Um the uh the mansion for the treasure it uh, caused trouble for her master that's why it's stated in the letters um containing the codes that the treasure isn't there then what about uh the hometown of the housekeeper and the sons they no longer own a house since uh it was sold after the housekeeper's husband passed away due to uh due to illness afterwards she put the children up for adoption and she continued to stay in the mansion where she worked as a housekeeper and it seems the four sons who got separated during their childhood never met each other even once in the past 30 years Hmm, well, I heard only the housekeeper, mom, and the eldest son were communicating with the three younger brothers. Um, then isn't it possible for some bad guy who happened to hear about the treasure to pretend to be, uh, to be one of the siblings? That's not a problem. On the palms of the four brothers, it seems there's an identifying mark. Identifying mark? It's a birthmark that they received when they were children. A birthmark? All of them? Uh, the story goes that they sustained, um, the injuries protecting their mother from being badly burned, huh? Then it's a mark of honor. Ransama, we've uh, been uh, walking um, for 10 minutes and 30 seconds. Have we not arrived in the, at the attendant location yet? I think we'll be there soon. I went there with my friend recently and it was really delicious. Oh, it's that place. Um, that cafe's pancakes are really tasty. Such a long queue. Tokyo people are so patient. It's nice to see. That's right. If it's a popular eating place, uh, hour-long waits are common. No, Ranchan, it's the Kyoto girl's way of being mean. She's actually saying these idle bastards want me to waste my time like this. <laughs> Dude, I like the Kyoto. I like the Kyoto girl's way of being mean. This is great. Oh, wait, what? I'm not being mean. I made sure to only insinuate it out of consideration as to spare her feelings. But you, had to just, but you just ended up hurting her more. Fuck it, Momo G. Jeez. Well, it'd be nice if they'd add up this time spent for queuing and the exhaustion and, uh, of standing up and subtract the, uh, them from the price of the food, wouldn't it? Add, subtract. Warehouse number four at Haido Port. The, the treasure is there, right, Shinichi Nichan? How did you get that? Indeed, Real Madrid was the key to the sol finding, solution, finding the solution. The ad is bolded in the first three codes. Ad could also be uh, read as ad. In other words, it tells you to add up the codes. So if you overlap the first three codes so that the ca characters are aligned, you'd get something like um, that. Uh, you'd get something that looks like a set of letters. Ah! I see. Um, but you can barely make it out. That's why the fourth sheet of code, uh, code is needed. On the last code, the um, rid is bolded, right? Rid as in uh, to get rid of, um, of, in other words, to subtract from the codes, which means we only need to erase the arrow signs from the, let, uh, from the weird letters that are formed after overlapping the first three codes. And just like that, uh, just like this, um, you get Haikaido um, Uno um, uh, Dai for Soku. The letters are now readable. Uh, that's what Shinichi Nichan said. It's true, I can read, um, Haido, uh, Ko Nu Dai for Soku. Uh, impressive. So if we go to the warehouse, uh, warehouse number four at Haido Port, we'd be able to find the treasure. Well, considering they both solved the code at the pretty much the same time, and this matches a draw, right? Is that really the case? Since Kodasama only relayed the answer after Kudasama had, uh, solved it and informed him, it means he's a tad faster than Notori-sama who blurted it out as soon as he solved the code, isn't he? True, Eeyore, you make a very valid point. No, you're wrong! Kudo also solved the code in immediately. Yeah, I also think that Shinichi Nichan was a bit faster. 
Look here, Kuda. I'll expose your identity for real. <laughs> Fucking Eiji. Just kidding. I was surprised by uh, Meiji Nichan's hot voice, and it, it said it alongside him without thinking, but both of them solved uh, the code at nearly the same, ex uh, the exact same time. Well, th this is inconvenient. Um, then how about this? We proceed to warehouse number four at Haido Port. The winner would be the one who fi first figures out the reason why the eldest son suddenly ceased communication. Are those terms uh, agreeable to you? Yeah, I don't mind. Shinichi Nichan said okay too. But who on earth are you guys? Uh, you predicted it would come to this and prepared to car beforehand, didn't ya? As well as that Ben's behind us for Rodney Chan and the others. Well, that's for some other time. Wait a minute. I'm thinking, no, okay. Hey, Momo, hey, Momochi, this time it all worked out since um, Heiji and Kudo kind of instantly solved the code, but after coming all the way to Tokyo, what would you have done if those two were unable to solve it? Indeed, I wonder. <laughs> so you didn't even consider it. So you didn't even consider it? Ah, so now we're at Haido Port. You're here because you've solved the code, and I will guide you to warehouse number four. I see, so you've been told if anyone comes and shows you the code to guide them to that warehouse. Yes, the warehouse was scheduled to be rebuilt this month, but the construction work got delayed at the request of the owner who uh, financed the reconstruction. Right now, uh, no one is using it, so it's empty. Could it be that there were people who came here before us? Oh, earlier this morning, a bearded man came here. Then another man came after him, and just now, two men arrived one after another. Four, pe four other people came already? Phrasing, could they be the four brothers? Um, then everyone has already solved the code. That one, that's warehouse number four. Uh, please let me know when you're about to leave. Hey, is anyone there? Hmm? Jeez, you could at least answer. Oh, there's a dead body! Yeah! Hey, what happened? Tell me! I have no idea. I was called here by my, um, by my big bro, but when I got here, he was already... I also got the message from my big brother to come here. I was sent a message um, by my elder brother, too, but when I came here, he was already dead. Then, it could, then could it be that the three of you are the three of the four brothers who received a code from their mother? That means the dead person is um, the eldest son, right? Wait a sec. What's with you guys? We were requested to solve the code in order to ascertain the safety and well-being of your eldest brother. Oh, so you're, so you're the acquaintances of the wealthy person. Our mother, uh, uh, wealthy person our mother worked for as a housekeeper, so... So, any clues as to the reason your older brother ended up like this? Maybe he slipped from, from there and fell to his death? It's not clear whether it's an accident or, or a suicide, though. Hey, did did any of you touch his, um, his corpse? No, I didn't touch it. Then it means this is, was neither an accident nor a suicide. This was a murder. Yes, it was. What? It looks like the culprit is amongst the three of you. That is true. I figured that was going to be the case. This isn't the time for a competition anymore. You're right. No, the person who first arrives at the truth of this case um, is undoubtedly the winner, right? The reason Conan and Heiji concluded uh, at a glance that it was a murder is... Damn it, we have to wait till next week. But, um... This, these chapters were good, and I'm so happy Heiji's back. I fucking love Heiji so goddamn much. Anyway... Very curious which brother uh, you think did it, and do you, what do you think Momochi's wish is? Do you think it's to marry Heiji, or to get a kiss, or something? Oh, very curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerd Again Zinc if you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive. So I can keep bringing you more Detective Conan content. There's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe, purchase something on my Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, find me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerd Again I will be seeing you later.